Hey ladies, it's Crazy Curly Cool. I wanted to do a quick update because you have my other video of when I did the LCO method and I went out into the heat and I sweated like crazy, but you don't have a video of me doing the LOC method, going out in the heat, sweating like crazy and coming back home. So this is the LOC method. Um, we went out, went to the lake today, beautiful lake in Fountain Hills, Arizona. Anyone that lives in Arizona, um, I'm sure you brought, probably have visited the fountain. It was beautiful. It was hot. It was disgusting. It was so hard to get comfortable. My, me and my husband were sitting there and all we could talk about was our sweat. <laughs> our sweaty bags. It was so crazy, but the kids had fun. But we sweated. I mean, my head got really humid. I could feel like the heat coming out of my head. It was crazy. And when I got in the car, I looked at myself in the mirror and this is what I saw. Um, oh, one of my best friends pointed out that I smack my lips a lot. I'm working on that, sorry. Anyway, um, so this hair was bleached about almost now. It was, it was a while ago, maybe almost a year ago. But this hair was bleached as well. The darker hair, I had actually taken half of my head and bleached it. And so um, I don't like to think that bleach is the issue here because look at this hair, look at this. Like, it's shiny. And then look at this hair under here that was bleached also almost a year ago, it's shiny. And then you have this dry hair. I, I think it's really just the color. I know that I, I've seen other vloggers that have, um, had, they had colored hair and then they went back dark and their hair looked healthy all of a sudden when before it really looked damaged. I think that's my issue here, but I don't know if I'm willing to change my hair color. I love my colorful hair. I try to change it as often as possible. I love it. So long story short, because I just went on and on about that. Um, I'm sorry, I'm holding my phone this time. So if you see it moving around a lot, I apologize. But uh, I think I'm going to be doing the LCO from now. That's the leave-in cream, or in my case, sometimes gel and oil. I, now that I have the comparison, I can actually look at the two and see the difference. I really, really believe that the LCO method's for me and I need to leave the lock method behind. When I was living in Chicago two and a half months ago, the lock method was amazing, but I'm in this crazy, there's no humidity here. You know, and it's just this dry heat and I see my hair being impacted. So I think I'm going to stick with the LCO method. I just wanted to fill you guys in on that. So just in case anyone's following my videos, you know that um, I actually decided to stick with that new method and leave my old method behind. So I hope this helps somebody. If you have any questions, feel free to, you know, leave a comment below. Or I know a lot of the people that have subscribed to my channel are on the Waves, Curls, and Kinks page. I love you guys so much. You guys are amazing. Anytime, tag me in anything and ask me any questions. And you know I'm honest. So if I realized I did the wrong thing and made the wrong decision, I'll be honest and say, okay, I'm going back. Because that wasn't for me. You know, I'm, I'm transparent. So if you have any questions... Feel free to reach out to me. Thank you so much for joining me again and good night from Arizona.